again the concept we are choosing here the pair of linear equations in the two variables in previous class we have discussed the solving the pair of linear equations graphically all the three methods are over here over there let us discuss in this class algebraic methods of solving pair of linear equations here now i am going to solve the problem only these the concept i have chosen here to make you people understand simple examples i am chosen here the first example here i am chosen is for the substitution method when we solve the two pair of linear equations here this is the first method of solving the pair of linear equation that is substitution method let us simplify substitution method means in one equation we have to solve that equation for any one of the variable after solving that variable value we have to substitute that value in the equation number 1 let us go for that one let us solve here here i will solve the equation number 1 for the any one of the variable here i will solve this equation for the value of x here the given equation is x minus 2y is equals to 3 if i solve it for x so x is equals to it becomes 3 take this minus 2y on this side it becomes a plus 2y is that clear here the value of x is 3 plus 2y 3 plus 2y here we got the value of variable x in the second equation if we substitute this in the first equation this is what the substitution method we have to substitute this value of x in the first equation let us take the equation number 1 the equation number 1 is 7x plus 7x minus 15y is equals to 2 if i substitute the value of x in this equation so this implies that is 7 into the value of x is 3 plus 2y minus 15y so is equals to this is equals to two children's here it means this equation totally it is in the only one variable if we solve this one we are going to get the value of y after getting the value of y we can substitute that value in the given equation to calculate the in third equation to find the value of x let us simplify this one 7 3 is a 21 plus into plus is plus 7 2 is a 14 y so minus 15 y is here is equals to 2 here we have simplified this one let us simplify this one again that is 21 take this 21 on that side it becomes our constants on one side variables on one side here i will simplify take the constant on this side that is 21 minus take this 2 on this side it becomes minus 2 so this is equals to take these two variable terms on the rhs side here it is a plus 14 y it becomes minus 14 y so here it is minus 15 y it becomes plus 15 y so this implies 21 minus 2 is 19 children's 19 is equals to <coughs> here minus 14 y plus 15 y is y so the value of y is 1 y so the value of y is 19 so we got the value of y let us find the value of x by substituting this value of y in equation number 3 that is equation number 3 is x is equals to 3 plus 2 y so this implies x is equals to 3 plus 2 into value of y is 19 so this implies children's so x is equals to 3 plus 19 to the 38 so this implies x is equals to 41 children's x is equals to 41 in this way we can find the value of x and y by using the substitution method whether these values are correct or not you can verify by substituting the values of x and y in any one of the equation here let us verify this one i will substitute these two values in the second equation so x minus 2y is equals to 3 so this implies x is what here x is 41 minus 2 into y is 19 so this is equals to 3 so this implies 41 minus 38 this is equals to 3 
so this implies children's 41 minus 38 is 3 it's 3 is equals to 3 hence it is verified or also you can substitute this value in the first equation to verify your answer to verify your answer this is how we can solve the pair of linear equations by using the substitution method substitution method